What are Chapter 9 Institutions? Welcome to the Civics Academy Constitutional Rights Series. These videos explore some of our constitutional rights and the institutions designed to support and enforce them. In order to assert our rights, we need to know their meaning and what they include. To use our democratic institutions appropriately, we need to understand their mandate and how they function. We discuss some of the institutions created by Chapter 9 of the Constitution. What are Chapter 9 institutions? The Constitution creates several institutions in Chapter 9 which aim to support and protect democracy and to promote and protect everyone's human rights. These are the Public Protector, the South African Human Rights Commission, the Commission for the Promotion and Protection of the Rights of Cultural, Religious and Linguistic Communities, the Commission for Gender Equality, the Auditor General, the Independent Electoral Commission, the Independent Communications Authority of South Africa. These institutions are separate from government and independent from political parties and other interest groups. They act as watchdogs by investigating wrongdoing and assisting people who struggle to gain access to government services. Some of these institutions are discussed in this video. Each institution plays a different role. The Public Protector Anyone can ask the Public Protector to investigate improper behaviour or actions by government representatives, abuse of power, rude or favourable treatment of a person, dishonest or improper conduct, or corruption. This is discussed in more detail in the video on the Public Protector. The South African Human Rights Commission The South African Human Rights Commission promotes all the rights protected in the Bill of Rights. The SAHRC is also tasked with making people aware of their rights in the Bill of Rights. It does this by visiting schools, churches, community halls and other institutions. If your rights have been infringed, you can complain to one of the SAHRC offices across the country online, in person, or by post or fax. The complaint forms are available on the website of the Human Rights Commission. Their lawyers can investigate the complaint, bring the parties together to try to resolve the dispute, or order the interference to stop. The Commission for Gender Equality CGE. The Commission for Gender Equality plays a similar role to the SAHRC but specifically deals with gender-related rights abuses. Anyone can lodge a complaint alleging gender discrimination or abuse and the CGE can help in the same way as the SAHRC. The forms to lodge a complaint are available on the website of the Commission for Gender Equality. The Auditor General The Auditor General monitors and reports on government spending. It inspects each government department and each municipality yearly to see whether money was wasted or to identify corruption. It publishes reports setting out how the municipality or government department managed its money and explains wrongdoing if necessary. The reports are published on the Auditor General's website where you can also find out if your municipality has spent its money wisely or whether there have been wastages. If the Auditor General received a complaint or request from the public, it can investigate them if it considers the matter to be in the public interest. The Independent Electoral Commission, IEC a democracy depends on free, transparent and fair elections. The Constitution therefore created the Independent Electoral Commission to manage elections for the national and provincial parliaments as well as for municipal councils.
The IEC does this by compiling and managing the voters' roll, which is a list of all citizens who are registered to vote. The IEC also manages the elections as such, including the election stations set up on election day. The IEC also counts the votes after the election and announces the results. This is how the IEC ensures that all elections remain free and fair and that voters can trust the outcome of the elections. You can approach one of their local or provincial offices, either in person or via email. The different offices and contact details can be found on the IEC website. Summary The Constitution created a set of independent Chapter 9 institutions to protect our democracy and human rights. Each institution plays a different role. Some receive complaints from the public, while others assist in other ways. All Chapter 9 institutions are meant to be champions of the people and of the South African democracy.